Hi everyone. I'm going to try to make a video here on how to rip audio music or music from an audio CD using Media Player version 12 as it is installed on Windows 7. It's a little different than Media Player version 11 that's installed in Vista. I haven't really practiced this and I'm not quite sure what problem is going to have so we'll find out. So I'm going to really right now I don't have any audio CD in the CD player right now but I am going to go ahead and I'm going to start media player. Go down here in the corner click on start and I don't see media player in my list so I'm going to all programs and I still don't see it. Still looking. Should have found it before I started recording. Here we go. Windows Media Player. Again, no audio CD in. Nothing here about ripping anywhere on the menus. It comes up in this kind of um, screen. I, apparently I'm looking at videos, uh, my videos library. I don't really want that. I'm not going to do much of anything at all here. But just for completeness, I will go up and click on Tools. I'm going to go down here to Options. I'm going to select Rip Music. And right now, the music from this video or from this audio CD that I'll be loading is going to be put on in my Dawn folder under Music. I could change it if I wanted to here. It will make an MP3. Okay, that's good enough for that. I don't I don't want to have this selected. I don't know if anyone would have this selected on their machine, but I don't want to start ripping a CD automatically. So I'm going to leave that unchecked. And I'm going to keep the quality about where it is just for the purposes of this demo. OK, we're going to click OK. So now presumably I am ready to load a CD and actually rip the music from the CD. It started playing automatically that you might hear in the background. Here is a whole new line. It came up automatically. There's a rip CD. First thing I'm going to do, and I'm going to shut this thing down or hit pause so you can hear me. Okay, so my CD put in, it generated this line right here. There's RIP CD, but it's all ready to go, except right now, the way it's set up, every single song on the CD will be uh, ripped, if you will. Well, I only want selected songs, so the first thing I'm going to do is go up here to this check mark where it says Album, and then there's a check mark here. I'm going to click that off. I notice now all the check marks have been removed for each song. So I'm going to click one or two that I want to rip, which is probably what you would do. So now I've got two songs selected. And now I'm ready to click on the button Rip CD. And now, as you can see, first one is starting to rip already. The other one is pending. And really, that's all there is to it. 